Yo, what's up everyone? Machi here. So I'm about to start up a stream where we're going to be rating 26 of the best Fortnite trade shots that have ever been hit. So as you can see, I put together some images and I made a tier list. So as you can see, the tiers we're going to be ranking the shots on are S, A, B, C, and D. S being the best, D being the worst, obviously. And here's all the shots we're going to rate. I'm going to show them to you guys as we go. But yeah, I'm about to start up my stream and we're going to do this live. If you want to participate in videos like these, once again, my Twitch link is going to be in the description and on the screen right now. Go follow me. Anyways, here we go. We're gonna start by alphabetical order. Our first shot is gonna be Berserk. I'm gonna go high, yeah? Do you oh, want me I to go high? Turn this down. So it's the mech GL ride to scuff jump off to bolt nosk what are we thinking about that that shot's kind of nuts that shot's kind of nuts hold on i might have to the first shot's gonna be the hardest to rank because i don't know like in comparison to the others so the the creativity and originality for this is off the charts because no one else has ever hit anything or done anything like this the cleanness however look he like tries to jump off the mech fails jumps off again doesn't pull anything out kind of an ugly shot so i might actually have to give this a d i'm sorry berserk but like i'm gonna leave this at the d tier for now all of these are like a tier or s tier but themselves but like i gotta have i can't just have everything in the s and a tiers you feel me i have to like spread them out all right next up we have brady looks like he's gonna grapple onto a ramp get sent up rocket ride grapple back can and then boom 106 meter bear no it's kind of nuts what are we think? definitely not an s tier because s tiers are just like you like you can tell if it's an s tier i feel like this deserves the b tier because it's not like super super original it's kind of just like like your average like banger you feel me yeah I th you guys are agreeing with me we're gonna again we can change this later on i'm gonna leave it at b for now all right we got decoy a lot of you probably haven't seen this but this is the only ever mythical goldfish yep someone hit this and it was a console player back in season three of this chapter Super, I don't know. I, I can't believe this shot's real. Like, I can't believe someone actually hit the mythical goldfish ride. Do I put this in the B tier as well? Like, it wasn't that distant either. Like, it's also just a send. It's just the chances. Getting the mythical goldfish is hard. Chat, what are you guys thinking? This is either A, B, or C. It's not D because it's just, I can't put it in the D tier. We're gonna leave this at the C tier, guys. For now, for now. All right, next up we got, are you a true Machi fan if you haven't seen this shot? Let's be honest. The dip volcano baller shot. just nothing to be said i think this is an s tier guys it has its own tier yeah that means it's an s tier because it was the best shot of chapter one i just have to put it at s tier no questions asked a because the fit is not good <laughs> anyways next up you guys will never guess who it is big daddy d vein honestly do i even have to say it for this shot thousand dollars on the stake thousand dollars on the line Literally one of the most, ins this is an S tier, obviously. No questions asked, this is an S tier. Accidental reload, which is now the d -vein reload, by the way. I'm gonna put it on the S tier. Dude, all these clips are so legendary. This probably was the best Fortnite clip of all time when it was hit. So he's gonna kill this guy with some traps in a bush. That's one, start counting. One headshot snipe, builds up the double ramp rush. This was in like season four or five, by the way. I believe it was five, it was five. Shockwaves. Watch, no scopes one, shotguns the other. Now, let me explain something. Let me explain something. A lot of you guys are saying S tier, but I think I'm gonna put this in the A tier because this doesn't have like the S tier factor that the other ones have. Like dip shot was the best shot of the season and Divin shot was for a thousand dollars. Exactly, it isn't iconic. It has S tier like quality, but I think we're gonna have to put this one on the A tier, boys. Another shot a lot of you guys may not have seen from Faria. Watch this. Best shot of season seven. Edit zone, launch pad, head bop ramp cone boom dude this is so nuts like especially for the time this is one of the best shots of all time when it was hit not iconic but crazy i think i think this is an a tier shot boys what are we thinking yeah all right i'm gonna leave it there for now again we can change it later next up we have a shot from this chapter actually the only shot in here from this chapter infinity he's gonna break a snowman i don't even know what happens in the shot to be honest it just looks cool emotes midair shockwaves and you already know what happens double dubs and shoots the guy out of a rift out of the air god damn like <sighs> who does that this is one of those shots that like the circumstances just like if you would have hit this shot on like an ai standing still it wouldn't even be on this list at all but just like the out of the rift makes it insane i'm gonna put this in a bro next up we got josh i kind of just picked out like a lot of shots that just got over 1k likes on twitter without looking at them i remember this though yeah he times the shockwave to land on it i'm gonna have to rewatch that again to do a quick analysis he like ej dashes onto the crash no he throws a crash in a shockwave and then ej dashes onto the crash 
crash lands, he builds up shock lands. It's like he predicts the entire shot. Stutter axes, insta swaps, and 210 meters, I believe. Bolt Nosk. Dude, I don't want to keep putting all of these at A tier, but I guess we'll do it for now. Like, my goal was to kind of have this spread out, but we might have to put this at A tier as well, bro. Actually, you know what? This may be a B tier for the cone sitting, boys. The shot's still good, but that might be what bumps it down from A to B tier. We're leaving cone sitting in 2020. Next up, we have the man himself, Josh TV. Dude, this might just this might just be an S tier. This might just be an S tier. I don't even understand this shot. Like, the fact that I've watched this over 10 times and still don't even understand it. It ends in a super... Look, he gets bandaged mid-shot. Stutter... Dude, it's so perfect. Like, could you ask for anything else? No discussing that it's an S tier? Listen, if it's that hard for me to understand it, like, how did he come up with it? You know what I'm saying? Like, and the fact that he hit it perfect, no scuff, 180 meters, stutter axe, bandage hits him in the storm, Sui. Like, all right, next up, we got another chapter one classic. Jaxify breaks the floor on the turret, lands on the quad crasher, and shoots the streamer behind a truck. S? I don't think this is S, dude. I honestly think this is an A tier. All right, we're, we're leaving that the A tier for now. All right, next up we got Lloydy. So rocket grapples through the window, opens a door, launch pad, grapple, launch pad, launch pad, grapple back, and boopy pulls out the grappler. To be honest, guys, I know a lot of you guys like this shot and consider it like a really good shot, but I'm not really like a huge fan of this shot. Like, it was really good for at the time, but next up we got, oh, look who it is. Do I even have to show this or have you all seen it a million times? If I shoved it in you guys' faces too many times. <clears throat> F tier worse than F? All right, man. This is like, I think this isn't that good of a shot by itself, but I think the iconicness of that and like the era it was hidden and how much it blew up on Twitter, like for reference, a good Fortnite trick shot rarely gets 2.2K likes. This one is 2.2K retweets. That shot started a wave of people trying to go for shots like that. Leaving it at S tier for now. Not to toot my own horn, but you know. All right, next up we got the legend, Phase Mew. I think this is the best shot. I would hope it is. Snipes one off the hoverboard. Hoverboard's up. Snipes one, and no scopes the other. Wow. This is nuts because no one like even thought of stuff like this on real players in chapter one. And Mew was just so ahead of his time that like he like was the only person able to do stuff like that. A solid A, solid A. Look at this, Nighty himself in the one shot game mode. Shockwave's up, breaks the van with a Barret. And no scopes him with a hunting, 125 meters. Nightmare. This is honestly a good shot for its time. I want to say B, maybe a C, but like I, I'm leaning towards B, guys. I'm leaning towards B. Hmm, B or C, B or C, it's so hard. All right, we're going to leave this at C for now. All right, now we got the leader of Obey himself, Raves. A lot of you definitely haven't seen this. This is like an obscure chapter one shot. He breaks the... I think he was the first person to start a shot like that, by the way. I don't think anyone like did stuff like this in chapter one. He breaks the floor onto a bouncer, edits a window, and headshots the guy with a bear. Oh hell no. I mean I think the shot's cool, but I'm gonna have to I'm gonna have to put that at the C tier. I mean if Nighty got C tier, I'm gonna put that at the C tier. Maybe even at Okay, if this shot was scuffed at all, I would put it at the D tier. Next up we got Rez. This shot was also hit on a streamer. What is this again? I, I honestly forgot. Was it a shield bubble ride? It was a shield bubble ride. Off the volcano, on a streamer, Nosk, 102 meters, Sui. To be honest, this shot was like really good at the time, but I don't think it aged that well, to be honest. I wanna put this at C. Actually, is it even a C? I'm gonna leave this at D for now. Just because it was a good shot at the time, but this shot gets hit 10 times a day now, at least. And like, it just didn't age well, you know, like in Storm Sense, Sui. Don't get me wrong, really good at the time. I think it was like the best shot this season, but did not age very well in terms of standards and the shots people hit now. All right, next up, we got Samzy, the retired trick shotter you guys know this shot don't you i i'm hoping you guys know this shot if you don't get out of here flint stink momentum barrett nos 112 meters in the storm suey with the gold trooper that doesn't add anything to it but the gold trooper is just cool and was the shot good yes did it age well no was it clean it probably would have been but it kind of lagged b yeah i actually have to agree with b because it's not like at, at the c level but it's also not at the a level next up we got shorty a lot of you guys said this was the best trick shot of this chapter so far which i mean i just dis i disagree because i like creativity but Jesus Christ, like that's no Oh wait, he hit that on a real kid, I forgot. Just to break that down real quick, he gets gauntlet send onto a bouncer, which sends him like 300 meters away. Fuck. 
He just gets sent so far and hits that on a real kid in a real lobby. That's why he gets the swag lines, as you can see here. I want to put this at the B tier as well because it's not that creative, it's not that unique, but the distance and like the impressiveness of this is crazy. Maybe like if this was a headshot, I'd put it at the A tier, but like, yeah, it's, it's just not like that creative of a shot. Oh, this is one of my favorite shots in the game, dude. This is so insane. This is honestly probably an A tier shot. So we got Soma with the launch pad to launch pad to bouncer to double flint to bolt nosk out of the cornfield reload 107 meters in smurfs Just, that shot's so clean it honestly deserves an a tier like this was the best state the game was ever in when you could play arena smurfs and have all these items that he has in his inventory and just get like the funnest lobbies that's not even a word but this shot was just so perfect, dude. Like, it, it symbolizes this stage of the game so well. Next up, we got Stellar with the only ever storm shield ride i mean i think this was clean and all like he didn't really scuff it and it, it's the only ever storm shield ride but I, again this wasn't that distance not that like unique just like a send that has never been hit again all right i think this has made me have like a kind of like a light bulb moment i think i will be bumping down the mythical goldfish ride to this tier just because i mean they're kind of the same if you think about it we have the man the myth the legend steezy x20 with dude this is like the best scope shot that will ever be hit in the history of the game the only ever clay pigeon ride the psychopath himself like do i have to say anything do i have to say anything dude look he times like when that thing is gonna shoot out a clay pigeon <laughs> If this was a Nosk, it would easily be S tier, but I think we can all agree on this being an, an A tier. Next up, we got Techie with one of the iconic parallel one year montage shots. Quad crashers up, passenger seat gets off of it, bounces on the hood, and ka -ching! So clean, that headshot is just like so crispy. Don't get me wrong, I love this shot, but I think a solid B tier for this one. Now we got Tenet, boys, the, the pioneer of editing trick shots himself. Shockwaves, tires, breaks a thing, edits two things, and the 200 meter NOS. All right, so let us let me break this down for you guys for a second, right? So he shockwaves, he bounces on the tires, he one shots that ramp with his AR, resets this cone, and edits this, which he didn't really have to edit, to be honest. And he NOSs the guy with like the little bridge, not really backdrop, but like a nice scenery, you know, to end the shot. This is like an A leaning to a B. Like an, this is like an A minus, if I had to say it. It's, it's like a B minus. All right, we got two more shots. This one is from uni. This one is kind of nuts. So I, don't, I'm, I can't even describe this. Just watch it, dude. Gotta be a psycho to do this. This shot was like crazy and all, but it was kind of barrel with the hunting and he did mess up the stutter axe. And like the, the execution, the ending of the shot wasn't as unique as like the shot itself, I guess. I don't know how to phrase it, but this is this is kind of giving me like C vibes, to be honest. In our final shot, we have our dear friend Voxby. Uh, I'm gonna show my perspective of this shot first. I'm not biased to this shot, guys. I genuinely think it's this good. I harpoon him through a window. Like, this is another one of the shots that you just can't explain. It's just like, it's more, okay. So I hit the crash pad, go through the window, harpoon him with me. He harpoons that wall and we both hit the crash pad. He spins and does a stutter axe as I harpoon him up onto the other crash pad and he harpoons the hunting that I dropped mid shot and he bounces on the crash pad and no scopes the guy from 200 meters with a glow glitch on his skin and with the skin change glitch. I honestly am leaning towards like S tier, but I wanna say A tier. I feel like if I say S tier, it's biased. Easily S? You guys are all saying S though. Okay, I don't think it's biased then. Like, is this is that actually an S tier? I think that's an S dude. Like me and two of my friends, I mean, technically, everyone here is my friend but me and two of my close friends are both are all in s tier am i biasing this like genuinely i want to know yeah like are we just nuts or am i biasing that I, we're just the best trick shotters bro we're like all right let's make some final revisions Devin says uni's bumped down jex is bumped up and voxby's bumped down I disagree with Voxby's and Jex's, but I might have to agree with Uni, just so there's at least three people at the D tier, you know, kind of to balance it out. Brady go down. I actually am going to have to agree with that one as well. I feel like Faria has to go down too. Josh is C. Yeah, I'm going to have to agree. Josh is a C. 
I think it's pretty good like this, to be quite honest. Maybe we need to bump one of these down to D. And out of those, I think that's going to be Decoy's Mythical Goldfish Ride. Bump Raves down and bump Josh down. That's it. You know what? That's a good call. All right. We have a nice balanced list, ladies and gentlemen. Best Fortnite trick shots. My opinion. Opinion. Lol. Don't get mad. Lol. Actually, nah, that's kind of like nice. You're mad low. Thank you guys for joining me in today's video. I don't know if I'm gonna end stream right now, but hey, say hi to the YouTube video. I really wanted to make this into a video because I saw a lot of YouTubers doing it with other things. And I decided, hey, like I am a Fortnite trick shutter, so I should do this. If you guys wanna check out my socials, links are gonna be in the description. If you wanna buy my merch, links are also gonna be in the description. If you buy my merch and send me a picture on Instagram or Twitter, I will follow you, I got you. Thank you for watching and peace.